Hey, what's good everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, I'm Max, and we're going to be working on a remix of Charlie XCX's new song, Forever. Um, I downloaded the stems yesterday, um, kind of got started on a little something. I don't know if I'm really feeling it. So I loaded um, the vocal, the lead vocal into Machine, and I used its um, sampling chop feature to just kind of automate some of these chops. Um, and we're just going to try to generate a rhythm. Um, I don't know if I'm going to pitch it up. I already brought it down to semitones. Um, I'm hearing something higher. But, I don't know, we're just going to kind of play around with it and see what happens. summery, breezy, kind of sunny, breathable mix. Um, so I think I'm going to try to start there and then see where we end up. Um, I kind of want to try to do, I don't know, I don't know what direction. <laughs> So I'm feeling pretty good. Um, I did some guitars and some drum stuff. Um, just some kind of rough arrangement right now. These two pedals um, are usually what I'll run a guitar through when I'm trying to do some atmospheric stuff. Um, creates nice texture. Blue Sky is a reverb and it's got a lot of great uh, modes like shimmer. It adds kind of like this octave. Harmonic. This is the um, Ibanez Echo Shifter. Um, I like this delay because it has an oscillation and a modulation as well. Um, and then it has, rather than a knob to affect the delay speed, it has this kind of slider, um, which allows you to just really warp it and get real crazy with it. I'm starting to get worried that it might be a little too close to the original, just the groove. It's sort of instinctual. Um, so I'm going to kind of just, just leave it as is, take a little break, come back, and see how it is. So yeah, um, I'm going to play you a little bit, and then take a break, and we'll see when we end up. SX, laying some drums down, and then this morning I kind of had an idea on where I wanted to take it, so I recorded this voice memo. So 
So yeah, I kind of want to try to um, do like a dancey B part, um, really funky. Um, so we are going to try to figure that out. I have some vocal samples loaded up that I'm going to try to throw in there. did it. It's done. All the parts are written. Everything's good. I'm happy with the mix. Um, I still want to tweak it and do some editing, but for the most part, it's done. So I kind of want to break down some of the stuff I did. I did a lot of it just kind of off camera. Um, yeah, a lot of late night, early morning sessions. I didn't go into this with really a plan. I didn't really intend to streamline anything. So when I bounced everything out, there's like 59 tracks total, half of them are in the front, half of them are in the back, um, because my computer was having trouble um, running the first session for the first half, so I broke it up into two, two different sessions. Um, so everything's here in the first half, and then we have this back half here. Um, so I'll kind of break down some of the things. There's nothing really that new in the first half, just some edits and mixing and transitional things, EQs and things like that, a um, little side chain and things here and there, but this back half is um, all pretty new. I think I filmed such the other day, um, but yeah, we'll just kind of get into it. So it's basically kind of all centered around this groove. Um, I'll solo these basses because I really like this bass part. So this is kind of the main groove you'll get. So it's kind of doing that and I'll combine that with just these two. This is just a kick and a snare. kind of just like the rhythm bottom part and then there's just a lot of atmosphere stuff there's like these this road this is a new vocal chop I did <laughs> doing that. Um, this is just sort of a loop. And then this just has a few little parts. And I did a couple some guitars. This is all maybe all yeah. These are all the guitars. To, these are all the guitars together. And I did this kind of almost like ska guitar. This guy I really like, so he just kind of creeps in near the end um, in sort of like an organized chaos. 
from the vocal. Um, yeah, just like a hi-hat. I did it on the um, SPDSX. Um, when I, I like to throw gates on it, it makes it sound kind of choppy and weird. There's this um, kind of blooming synth kind of glistening arpeggio thing. And I also added this kind of arpeggio. This keyboard, um, it's a Casio and it has a built-in arpeggiator and I like to just sort of set the internal MIDI clock to a different tempo than this one. I'll usually just, it maxes out around 225. Um, so that creates these like really wide sweeping um, arpeggios that I like to play over the beat and it kind of creates this like warping. And I usually set the pan to sort of flutter between the left and the right. So that's it. Um, I'm just going to do a little bit more mixing and some editing and then it's done. Alright, before I play the full remix, I just wanted to thank you for watching this video. Um, you can find a link to the original song down below. Charlie did an awesome job. It's a great song. Um, you can also find links to my music and other things as well. Um, let me know in the comments what uh, you'd like to see me do. I'm thinking about doing live streams and some other things. Um, let me know what you'd like to see. I can maybe break down um, this session and some other things. So just let me know. Um, i got more videos on the way. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks.